Okay, so let's break down our final plant category. This is the fun one that everybody is like usually asking about if they've been in pain. Um, so let's talk about alkaloids. They're analgesic, psychotropic, which includes like sedative, hypnotic, stimulants, um, that kind of thing. Um, they're a bronchodilator and antispasmodic, and it all lumps into one category of alkaloids. Alkaloids, sorry. Um, so the strength of the alkaloid, it's going to vary between the plants and the herbs um, and how much of it you take. So you can actually use herbs to manage pain, to counter stress, um, counter tension, to help with sleep, to help with muscular spasms, that kind of thing. And that all of those herbs fall under alkaloids category. Now, when you go into that category, this is the one that you're going to get the most warnings with, the most drug interactions, um, told not to drive until you know how it affects you, that kind of thing. Those are all going to fit under this category. This is another one you can probably break down again into multiple videos if y'all want to learn more about it. But I would say like passion flower, vervain, hops, ashwagandha, valerian root, poppy seed, those all fit under the alkaloid category. And that's our final one on the plant category. Let me know if you guys want me to break down any of these categories and actually give more detail to it. Because like I said, this was just kind of an overview of the plant categories and because it was asked for. And we're working on the school, but comment, like, let me know if you like this or if you just want me to go back to the Karen skits. Thanks, guys.